This is a quick assembly instructions for the 9-day headboard adapter. Some people buy a 9-day headboard and want to put a metal frame to it, and you'll take these sharp screws and drill right into the wood, making an ugly hole that wasn't there. But since the holes are already drilled in a headboard, we came up with a plate, an adapter plate, that has holes drilled up at the same pattern. It also has a slot that you can then attach your metal frame to. Now, the plates are reversible so that you can make the... Uh, spacing wider or narrower. We're going to start with that. It also comes with a set of hardware just to attach the metal frame to the plate. But if the uh, metal frame that you have isn't doesn't have big enough holes, we've uh, including some six millimeter bolts so that you can line it up with that. First thing we're to do is attach the plate to the metal frame, but we need to make sure our spacing is right. So we're going to turn that back and forth and make sure it lines up. Of course, what we're doing is the screws that come in the headboard box will go through and we're going to put the plate on and we're going to go ahead and just put that end cap on there just so that it holds it in place for a second while we do that. And that way we can now make sure that that uh, metal frame is going to line up with our slot nicely. Once we know it is, then we can put our screw. Here I used a six millimeter bolt and then a washer and a nut and put it on there but I left it loose again because I need to be able to move it back and forth a little bit to make sure it's going to line up with those holes back there. Now let's go ahead and attach the plate to the headboard using the wood screws that come in the headboard box and I line it up, put the screws through, catch the inserts that are in the, the wood cap and there we go nice and tight and snug. And since we are now snug on the headboard, let's go ahead and snug up the metal frame. Here I used a socket wrench. I found it easier than a pair of pliers or trying to get in behind it with an Allen wrench or a Phillips screwdriver. So this makes it easy to just tighten that up and boom, we're there. We're nice, solid and attached. Now, a little tip, the wider apart that you can make those two screws, the less wobble you'll get in the headboard. So use the wider tracks if you can. And that's it. That's how you do an adapter from night and day.